Time for another mystery box from Miro Games. What's up everybody, I'm Tylock and this is Homespun Geek. What's up guys? Yes, I bought another mystery box from Miro Games. They had a $14.99 guaranteed value mystery box. Uh, there were a lot of exclusives in it. I was not disappointed the last time I bought from Miro Games, which was my first time. Uh, I got a LeBron James pop. It was an exclusive pop. It did have some value to it. Uh, so it definitely wasn't a loss for me. Uh, so I decided to go back and try them again. $14.99 is not really bad for a mystery box, especially when it guarantees value and there was a lot of really good stuff in that picture uh, that I would really like to have uh, so speaking of the picture let me show you guys the picture of what they had on offer it should be right here uh, so yeah there's a lot of exclusives some chases some good-looking stuff in here uh, almost anything in this box I wouldn't mind getting the only thing that I can think of that I have already from this picture uh, there were two Smees in that picture I already have two Smees I have one that we got with our Disney treasures whenever that was the Pirates Cove box and then I have one that I got from Chalice Mystery Box uh, the last time I don't want another Smee I don't need another Smee uh, the only other thing in there that I kind of wouldn't really want was the Super Saiyan God Super Saiyan uh, Vegito but let's be honest, you can't have too many of those, I don't think. I mean, anything anime, duplicates from anything anime, I would be okay with because I'm sure there's people out there that wouldn't mind them and I can always find a home for them. So, uh, Smee, on the other hand, I think is going to probably go into my uh, giveaway at some point. Maybe I'll do a Disney-themed giveaway and that is probably what will be in that giveaway. So, uh, anyway, guys, let's start. $14.99, you guys saw the picture, everything that was in there, uh, hopefully it's something good. There didn't seem to be that many sports pops in that picture, so hopefully it's not another sports pop because I don't need any of those. Uh, and I, I don't want Smee, for sure, I don't want Smee. But if, if it is Smee, I guess I'll be doing two giveaways with a SME. So, uh, all right, guys. So, like I said, MiroGames.com. I will put a link in the description below so you guys can check that out. But let's go ahead and open this box and see what they sent over here. Okay, guys? Uh, if memory serves me right, the last time that I ordered a box from them, it actually came in a pop shield. So, that is actually really cool. And it, it shows appreciation for what they're shipping, and I like that a lot. Uh, so, when you open this, guys, it is a brown paper box this this is the paper similar to the way poptopia does it uh it does feel like let's see yeah it kind of feels like it might be yeah it's a definitely in a pop protector guys so uh all right let's see I'm trying to find the the top of it yep it's a pop protector it is a pop shield yep it's a pop shield all right, so here we go, guys. $14.99. You guys saw the picture. Let's see what I got from that picture. Uh, I think everybody got something from the picture, guys. So here we go. Oh, yes, yes, yes. You guys, Funko 2016 New York Comic Con limited edition Shane Walsh. Uh, that is Shane from The Walking Dead. He was Rick's uh, deputy. Um Wow, that's a good one, guys. Uh, I do remember him being in the picture towards the top of that picture, and that's definitely, like I said, guys, almost everything in that picture I would have been okay with, except maybe Smee. Uh, but yes, that is a great pop. It is in a pop shield. Still has the plastic on it. I'm going to take the plastic off, uh, just like I did last time. Just hopefully you guys will get a better picture of it. Uh, let's see. This is actually like super exciting. This is a con exclusive that I've never seen in person. Uh, all right, well that's good enough for now. All right guys, so there it is. I took the plastic off, if that's a better picture hopefully. Uh, Shane Walsh from The Walking Dead. Uh, this is a New York Comic Con limited edition Funko 2016. Uh, there's the bottom. It looks like it has everything on it. Very, very exciting, guys. I like this pop a lot. Uh, yeah, I really like Shane, actually. Uh, I know he did some bad things in the end, but I, I like Shane. He was trying to keep his friends alive, so. All right, guys. So, yeah, Shane Walsh 
from The Walking Dead 2016. Let's look up the value, guys, real quick. Let's see what this is valued at so we know for sure whether or not this was a $14.99, you know, map value. Because uh, they did say guaranteed value $14.99. I can't see why that wouldn't be valued at least $14.99 if it's a con exclusive. So, all right, guys. So, yeah, Shane Walsh. New York Comic Con 2016. This is with the con sticker. Uh, New York Comic Con, that's the con sticker. That's not a shared exclusive sticker. That's a limited edition New York Comic Con sticker. Uh, that actually very well may be my first time to ever get a con sticker instead of like the shared stickers you guys see on a lot of them. Uh, might be the first one I've ever gotten. I'm not really sure, to be honest with you. Uh, but yeah. That's awesome. I do have a Walking Dead collection. I am a Walking Dead fan. Uh, I've read every comic book and seen every episode of The Walking Dead. Uh, I don't have a giant Walking Dead collection. I have Abraham, uh, who's one of my favorite characters. Herschel, who is w one of my absolute favorite characters. Uh, two versions of Negan and then the original Rick that they came out with. Uh, and that's all I have as far as The Walking Dead goes, guys. So now I have Shane Walsh, uh, the very first true villain in The Walking Dead, guys. Tell me what you think, guys, in the comments below. I'm really eager to hear what you guys have to say. The value on this pop, guys, was $19. So $19, I definitely got my value. They guaranteed $14.99 value. I hit $19. So, so yeah, guys, I definitely did well on that box. I think so. Tell me if you guys think so. So that's really all I have for you guys today. I'm sorry that this is a short video. This will probably make two short videos in a row, but uh, I just wanted to get this one open because I was really eager for this box uh, because there are so many things in that picture that I really liked. So probably going to keep doing Miro games. To be honest with you guys, I really like Miro games. Uh, I know they're not like selling out quickly, which is fine by me because as long as nobody else is buying it, I'll keep going in and grabbing them. So anyway, guys, that's all I have for you guys today. So as always, I am Tylock. This is Homespun Geek, and I hope you have a nice day.